Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to The Dig for more point and click adventure game action. We are back where we left off after a big fight between Brink, who is now down here somewhere, um, dead potentially, I'll get onto that in a minute, and Boston. Uh, Brink in the last one toppled off the ledge after trying to smash Boston's head in with a big rock. Something tells me that he's not dead though, I, I don't know why. I think it's probably just a case of... It needs the part. Yeah, I don't want to make any more crystals. I don't know. I think he's survived for so long. He's already died once. And I just get the impression that maybe the crystals have given him some sort of power that he can survive that fall. Um, I might be completely wrong about that, but I just don't trust that he's actually <laughs> fully gone away. Um, I don't know. I, I got the feeling as I was playing the game that Brink was going to eventually take so many crystals that he was going to turn into one of those little spirit things. Um, and I'm... I may be completely wrong about that, but I just get the feeling that the game, well, I thought the game would go in that direction, that Brink would basically take so many crystals, he'd become a little spirit thing, so it wouldn't surprise me if the crystals have given him some sort of power that he can survive that drop, and then he takes more crystals and becomes the little spirit thing. It just, I don't know, it just seems like the type of thing that will happen in this game to me. We'll see. Um... These things still don't make sense to me, but I guess we might figure these out now because we've got the crystals and we've got the... They're really freaky, aren't they? We've got the crystals, we've got the eye part, so we're going to come down to the machine and we're going to put it all in and see what happens. And yeah, hopefully we'll be able to power this up and figure out what to do with that doorway at the top of all the, the light bridges. So let's put the eye part in first. The alien was right. He this was right. Already killed one of us. Well, yeah. But it's back in place. It is back in place, right? One, two. A crystal's brink died for. So what? What did that do? Yeah, brink died for this. So hopefully this works. Is something happening? I mean, it's powered up. What happens if we touch these now? Then do these do anything different? Because there was this console as well. Maybe we can interact with this now. It's definitely powered. Unless it's just powered up the doorway, of course. Uh, anything... Slightly different shape, perhaps. And it's continuing to do the little... Thing. So do we have to touch all of them? Oh no, it's stopped now. It is a different shape though, it looks like a, almost like a UFO type thing when it goes like that. It's a row of crystalline devices. Okay. Well it lasts for longer but it does stop. So that's interesting. Right, the controls, okay. I forgot there were controls here. I don't know how to work these controls. Right, we don't know how to work those. Uh, I mean these ones look slightly different, don't they? What does this do? No, that's still doing the same. Why is Maggie not following us now? Do we have to do something with this? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, Maggie, any ideas? I feel like I'm just what he called me. A traitor. A liar. You were dealing with a madman. That's true. You were trying to save him too. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? It's probably our only chance of getting home. Well, we've done it, so... Uh, okay. <clears throat> Is that... What oh, no, that's the island. That inscription and taken it with me? We could have wandered around here until we died without ever finding that island. They hide it. Then they help us find it. Who can understand why aliens do what they do? Maybe it's a test of our intelligence. Or maybe it's a test of our dumb luck. Maybe it's neither. Or our persistence. <clears throat> yeah, maybe it's like a sort of a case of proving yourself. Thanks. Uh, right, so can we do anything with this then? I don't know what to do with this device. No. Okay, maybe it all just works then. Maybe it's just a case of going up to the... to the light bridges and... and trying to walk through the, the doorway. So I guess that's what we try. Yeah, she's coming with us now. I wonder why she was standing up there and not coming down to the console. I'm sure she followed us down there before. 
Anyway, light bridge. So, is this all working now? We'll go to the eye. Uh, it still looks like it's doing that weird pulsing thing. It doesn't look safe to walk there. So it's not safe yet. So it doesn't look safe to walk there. Huh. Okay. So we must Robins. be. We no, I don't want to talk to Robbins. Never mind. We must be missing something then. Then we must have to use those controls in some way. But the question is how. How do we use those controls? Because it doesn't even give us a, a chance to, does it? He just says that he doesn't know how to use it. Here are the controls. Yeah, look, she just stays here. Maggie, do you have any ideas? Robbins. Oh, I can what? You still hanging in there? Why can I talk to her from there? I'm okay, Boston. Don't worry about me. All right. Well, thanks. So we've got to do something with this, right? Work these Can this thing help us? It won't do anything. No. Huh. There's some more flashy lights here. We must be missing something then. But the question is, what? What are we missing? Is it something to do with these strange objects? We can still interact with this, weirdly. I'm not really... What do, what do these do? There must be something we can do with these, right? Because they just wouldn't be there if they didn't do anything, surely. I mean, does it... Does it help us use the controls? I don't know how to work these controls. Does the tablet work on it? I can't use these two things together. No. We do still have the tablet though, which makes me wonder if maybe Maggie can use it again. Let's try. Good work deciphering the tablet, Maggie. Thanks. We make a pretty good team. No, we can't. That doesn't mean I want to get marooned again though. <laughs> Yeah, good Robin. good point. Right. What do we do here because uh I feel like I'm just what he called me. Well, we said that already. A traitor. A liar. You were dealing with a madman. You were trying to save him too. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? It's probably our only chance of getting home. Wait, what? Try the part in the Thanks. So do we have to take... Wait, I'm, I'm pretty confused. So do we have to take that up to the actual eye? And, and use it that way? I guess I'll take this... Oops. Hang on one second, guys. Sorry. <laughs> right, okay. I always forget that if I click slightly off the screen because it's a tiny window, it pauses the game. So, <laughs> my bad. Um... And then I always end up clicking on um, my recording software to try and click the screen, and of course it's not the screen. Uh, right, so that's gone yellow now. Because that part's not in there. I don't suppose this will work in any other machines. It won't do anything. No. Right, well let's go up to the eye again and try this up there. There must be something that we're missing here. But I can't really figure out what. Um. Mm. I mean, he said, should we try this in the eye, didn't he? So, and this is the eye, so maybe we just use this thing here? It won't accomplish anything. No. But the eye part with the eye. It won't do anything. I feel like I'm just what he called me. Okay, we don't want to do that Traitor. again. You were dealing uh, with man. Oh, the conversation just continues, does it? <laughs> Fair enough. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? It's probably our only chance of getting home. See, he says about trying the part in the eye, which is why I thought maybe that was what we had to do. But apparently not. 
Um, why does she wait up? Unless we have to... Can we use this on the alien device? It won't do anything. No, so that... I'm pretty confused, if I'm honest. I'm not, I'm not really sure what we're doing here. The controls are weird. Like, I don't... I feel like we've got to use these. But the question is how? How do we use these controls? Okay, sorry about that, guys. There was a delivery at the door. I don't know if you could hear the knock on the microphone, but I had to go and um, answer that because it was a Christmas present that I've been waiting for. So, um, what were we saying before? We were rudely interrupted with Tiny Turian's, well, one of Tiny Turian's Christmas presents. Um, we were talking about the eye, weren't we? And whether we can, can we use it on the strange objects? Was that what we were trying to do? It won't accomplish anything. No, so we can push all of these, but they don't seem to be doing anything. That one's not... So that's not working. Controls. I don't know how to work these controls. They just don't work. Does Maggie know how to do it? Like we tried the tablet, didn't we? We've tried. I feel like I'm just what he called me. Right, we've done that line. A traitor. A liar. You were dealing with a madman. You were trying to save him too. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? It's probably our only chance of getting home. I don't... Thanks. So, I mean, we tried it in the eye, like he said, and that, that just didn't work. So this thing has got to go in the machine, right? The special slot for it is in the machine, so it's got to go in there. We tried using it with all these controls, everything, and it's just, it's just not working. That's the bottom line. So... I think it's just going to have to go in here. I, I don't see where else it can go. I know it can go in Brink's little machine with the crystals, but... Yeah, it's, it's got to go in there. Look, that's turned that green. And now I can hear like a whirring sound, so it must go in there. I don't really see what else we can do with it, so I'm, I'm going with that. The question is now, what the hell do we do? Do we use the alien device at the top? We can't use the controls. Maggie won't do anything with the tablet. These things react to us, but don't seem to do anything. He doesn't know what to do with this. I don't know what to do with this device. Robbins. Do you know what to do here? I don't here? know about you, but I'm starting to get tired. I've done a lot of digging. <laughs> and I've done so much it's called the dick. Right, so we've got the eye part, the strange device is the, right. What's the alien device? You're the one who read the alien books. Okay, that what was exactly that was weird. When we turn it on with enough life crystals in it, it would have taken me years to read everything. That's kind of weird because it it just tra like teleported us. But there's no doubt that this machine is dangerous. The alien warned us it might cost us more than we expected. What does that mean? I don't know. I guess we'll it find might out. Mean that just turning on the machine might kill us. Mm. You mean he booby trapped the thing? I mean that the machine may draw on more than life crystals. Oh, like it will draw on us. The life out of whoever uses it. Ooh. Then I'm running the controls. Don't be absurd. It might do nothing too. <laughs> yeah, that'd be or quite I ironic. Whoever isn't at the controls. I just want to tell you. No goodbyes. We're gonna make it home together, Maggie. Yeah, we're gonna make it. We're both gonna make it. That is I'm for not sure. Sentimental, Boston. I wasn't going to say goodbye. Oh. I just want you to promise me something. Say goodbye to my After family. You saw me break every promise I made to Brink. You want me to make another one to you? What happened with Brink couldn't be helped, Boston. I know you'll keep your word with me. 
What's the promise? I don't know where this is going. If I die and you live, don't use any life crystals on me. Don't revive me. Do you understand? Are you sure? Oh god, I've got a horrible feeling about I this. I saw what Brink became. I don't want that to happen to me. You wouldn't be saving Maggie Robbins. You'd be creating a monster with my memories, my face. I really don't like where this is going. You promise me. I promise, Maggie. And vice versa, okay? All right. And now you tell me the truth about something, Maggie. Are you sure you didn't find out somewhere that something bad happens to the person at the controls of this machine? Oh. Boston, I don't know any more than you do about what will happen when I switch this thing on. I wonder if she did. If that's a lie, I'm going to be really ticked off, Maggie. Yeah, I know. Oh, so I wonder if she did see something then. Here we go. I hope she doesn't die. She's been a really good character. That's how you use the controls. So she must have read how to use it, right? Whoa, check this out. I've got a very bad feeling about this. I hope we haven't done something wrong. Whoa! <gasps> the doorway! Oh, no. Oh, she's alright, she's alright. No, she's not. Look, she looks all funny. Is she dead? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh god, she's dead as well! Oh, I bet Brink flipping comes back now as well. She said... She's actually dead, what the hell? I mean, we don't... Oh god, what do we do? She said not to use any crystals on her, but I feel like... I feel bad if we leave her. I feel really bad if we leave her. But then she did make us promise, didn't she? She said, if I die... She, I bet she knew this was going to happen, which is why she said it. But if she said, if I die, don't use any crystals because it will turn me into one of those things like Brink. So as difficult it is as it is, I guess we're going to have to leave her behind. God, we lost Brink last time and I, I didn't really feel that bad about it. <laughs> but this one is tough to take. Really tough to take. Hopefully this isn't some sort of timed thing and I've <laughs> screwed it up by talking on. Alright, let's get to the eye then and go through the doorway. And I guess then we'll be home. Hopefully. Maybe not. Maybe we'll go somewhere else and we're going to have to do everything by ourselves. Oh god, it's one of those things. Uh I should have known the inventor would have one more trick up his sleeve. Oh really? Okay, so that's not working. So, do we have anything we can use? It won't accomplish anything. No. Okay, well, I've got an idea. Right, can we turn this off? Can we... can we do that? Yes, we can! Alright, well, there he goes. That was easy. That was the inventor's last chance to stop me. 
I will get out into space time six. I will bring the people of this place back home, and they will build me a starship that will take me back to Earth. Oh man, okay, so let's power it back up. Well, I mean, that was something, wasn't it? Um, okay then, I think we'll leave it there. Um, in the next one, we'll go through the little little door, I think. Um, I don't know how much longer of this is left. I mean, it might literally be sort of 10 minutes or so, but I think we'll have to do it in the next one because we're approaching time. Um, and I don't want to sort of go massively over if, if we've still got more that we need to do here. So, we'll leave it there, but holy crap, Maggie, I can't believe it. <laughs> I can't believe it, it's just going to be us. And even then I still get the feeling that Brink's going to show back up in some sort of like spirit form and try to kill us or something, so God knows what will happen next time. But as always guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button, it really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.